Right, in this video I'm just going to add some very simple animations uh, to two sets of shapes, the shapes being the or a text box and a rounded rectangle. We're going to animate this part first and then followed by this. And this is very simple animation just to get you started. Okay. Uh, the reason why this goes first is because it's the first part of the example in the push-up uh, for mechanical energy. Okay. So I'm going to shift click on both the rounded rectangle and uh, text box. Shift click of course is just holding down shift and then left clicking on your chosen shape. Then you go to the top, click on animations and then select your style. Uh, for this example I'm just going to use blinds and after that I want to make sure that it plays straight away so just like with previous. So that does for both of them, because I've uh, selected both, it adds with previous to both. And then what you do here for these two is, well, depending on what you want to do, but I want this to come after the previous animation. So this, let's do that. So shift click on both uh, the rounded rectangle and text box, up to animation, select your style. I'm boring, I'm going for blinds. That's done. And then this time just change it to after previous which again does it for both, okay, and this little uh, clock denotes that as well, that it will play after. If you hover your mouse over the animations in the animation pane, it tells you what it, the summary of your animation. And then test it, yep, you can do preview, but I'd like to go to the full preview, play from current slide, click that one, that appears and then that appears. And in the next video, we'll look at adding in timings. Thank you for watching.